Hello everyone. Good, Good morning. morning. It's a beautiful morning in Paris. And we are at our window admiring this beautiful street view. It's good to be back in the city after seven years. Seven years, yes, indeed. Last time when we came, we saw all the major attractions like Louvre Museum, Catacombs, Statue of Liberty. But it really feels incomplete if you come to Paris and don't visit Eiffel Tower, as they say in English. In English, yes, but in French, it's called as Eiffel Tower. Eiffel. My kids are tired from yesterday's Disneyland trip, so they are still sleeping. Which is why we are taking our own sweet time to get ready. But first, let's arrange breakfast. We have come to nearby local supermarket to see and explore what do they have. In the previous video, we have mentioned that we took the Airbnb apartment. One important reason to take was to avoid waking up early for the breakfast. Generally, when you stay in the hotel with breakfast option, then as per the rules, you can have breakfast between 6 to 10 a.m. strictly. And since we wanted some flexibility and spend the vacation on our terms, we did not choose the hot hour. We have bought some additional food items as well, just in case if someone gets hungry late in the night. When you have very young kids with you, you cannot expect them to just wake up in the morning and then get ready for the heavy breakfast. My kids don't know about our itinerary, so we are going to surprise them with a visit to famous Eiffel Tower. We are taking the train, as clearly the railway station is right next to our apartment. Even if it is not near, we always prefer taking trains or metros in Europe because it's very convenient, time-saving and cost-effective. You can also go to Eiffel Tower by Big Bus Tour but today we are going by train. We do believe Europe is best explored in trains and on foot rather than cabs, cars or buses. This location is called Tokadeho. It is situated on the opposite side of scene from Eiffel Tower. It's a perfect picturesque location. After taking several pictures and videos, now we are heading to Sham Dimas lawn area. This is another iconic location right under the tower. But let me tell you, it's a good 30 40 minutes walk from this place to the Eiffel Tower. You will find several street vendors in Paris selling various items like souvenir water bottles and hats. Even we are tempted to buy a famous parrot hat. They are really good guys selling at a very reasonable price compared to the other stalls. You can buy from them and you can support them. Other destinations are not, but the Eiffel Tower will always be associated when you speak of Paris, which is why you will see so many people from around the world who come to Paris will always visit the Eiffel Tower. Summer is generally very crowded because that's the time majority of the people actually come to Europe. It's largely due to school holidays. So you will see a lot of families with young children here at this time. Always used to wonder how do they take the pictures right in the center line of Eiffel Tower. So this is how they do it standing in the middle of the road. Wow. You must have seen this kind of beautiful pictures on the street in front of Eiffel Tower on Instagram. Doesn't matter. Now, it's my princess's turn to take some beautiful pictures. This place has a lot of temporary stalls offering finger food and beverages. Apart from this, there are few dining options near the river cruise area. You can take cruise and enjoy a meal depending on your budget. We like to collect souvenirs from different places. This Eiffel Tower with the light looks really amazing. We need to buy one. 
This is the entrance where you can go on the top of the Eiffel Tower. There are two options of going on the top. One is either by stairs or by elevator. This prize you see on the screen is to go to the top of the Eiffel Tower. There are a lot of attractions and distractions on the street of Paris. You have to take care of yourself and your belongings. There are various river cruise from Eiffel Tower which offer city sightseeing by river. The duration of these cruises is from one and a half hour to two and a half hour. If you like our video, please do subscribe, like and share. It's time for us to go back home. See you. Bye-bye.